Hey guys, welcome to the next part of Let's Play Football Manager 2012. We are now at the Mestalla for Valencia versus Atletico Madrid. Uh, it should be a good game. Uh, you know, a lot of big teams in uh, La Liga that I recognise. Well, seven or eight. <laughs> the rest I probably won't be able to recognise, like players and so on. But this team is one, of course, I am able to, with the likes of Jordi Alba, uh, Manega, Giovanni Dos Santos, uh, I think it is. Probably is. I don't know, it's about a million Gio Dos Santos or so. <laughs> probably think of the wrong one, but who cares? Uh, Soldado, Rami, um, you know, good players. So, yeah, uh, looking at our team, we're going to keep with the asymmetrical formation. Uh, just the one change, Makeda comes in for his, uh, not a full debut, it's, uh, well, it's his La Liga debut. Um, but because uh, Falcao got injured on international duty, he's only out for a week, so should be back for, well, I don't know, I'm not too sure, who, who are we playing here? Uh, Metali, oh, Met Metalist, okay, sorry, who's that? Oh, Metal, Metal Car Keys, so that's what I'm going to, actually, I'm going to go on that now. Um, can I, actually, no, damn, I can't give them nick. I can't, wish I could give teams nicknames. That would be great. I was going to call them Metal Car Keys, but you can't. I'll just call them that myself. Anyway, so yeah, it's an unchanged team from the uh, Osasuna game. And uh, let's get to it. There was an international break in this, so that's, um, well, you know, obviously that's what's going through. But let's, I reckon, go to control here. Now, Valencia are a good team on this, as we all know. And, um, yeah, well, I will not say the title, but whatever. Um, now, I'd just like to say something real quickly. I've just, uh, I'm not going to pull any, I'm not going to make any uh, shits and giggles here or anything. I'm not going to life you guys i just rage quit this um i just started playing this and i rage quit uh but for good reason um godin got sent off in 10 minutes dominguez then got sent off in 15 minutes half time we were down five nil i'm sure you can understand why i rage quit then and antonio lopez has picked up an injury oh my god hit the post oh my word valencia are absolutely yeah, I think I need to sort these tactics. I call me a cheat if you want. I really don't give a shit. Um, <laughs> I just rage quit. It was just annoying the fuck out of me. Um, I didn't know what to do. Anyway, Antonio Lopez, who I think is the captain today, is not that badly injured. He can make it through at least till half time. But at least we're doing better than the bloody last game where I rage quit. So, but yeah, trust me, I won't. I very rarely rage quit. But that was one of the cases where I just had to because that was just completely ridiculous. Um, Oh, look at it. Oh, passing was... That was really good passing. Oh, look at it. Oh, it. It's like Arsenal. They just overplayed that too much there. Need to open up with a shot eventually. All right, can we get something like that? Because a big... Could be three big points if we got them against uh, Valencia. We're not going to get them with shots like that. But, you know, it could be three big points there against Valencia on grabs today if we could get them. Yeah, I think it really would signal, you know, maybe this team is, in fact, actually really good. Um, oh, he's got sent off again! No way! What the fuck? Are you see, okay, I think you can see what I'm, what's going on here, right? I'm gonna have to take Suarez off for, um, Christ Ferreira, I suppose. Um, Pereira can play in the midfield. I reckon go back to okay, four four two. Um, oops, hang on, wrong one. Oh, fuck me. Um, okay, actually, Makeda's playing at the wrong bloody thing again. Um, target man. I can count. I can go counter. Okay, the same damn thing's happening again. Now, this pisses me off. Why can't Diego and Arda Turan play in centre midfield and wide to respect the line? I know they're attacking players, but why can't they just play normally centre midfield? That makes absolutely no sense to me. In fact, can anyone play a front? Can any of these. Ah, oh, fucking hell. Um. Can Fran, who can play up front? Actually, one Frank can play up front, can't he? No, he can't. That's brilliant. Um, fuck it. They're going to have to play there. Tough shit. They're going to have to play there. Um, <clears throat> so, we'll see what we can do. I need four, you need four defenders. You can't go to the Mastaya with three defenders. That's ridiculous. Uh, but if we can make it to half-time, I think we will. But if we can make it to half-time, we've got a target man up front with no one to flick it onto. That's really good. Thanks. Dominguez just fucking lost us the game again, as he did in the in the first game. I blame Sammy Lee. He's probably telling telling them all to hack hack each other again, as uh, he did with my local save. Those who watched way back at the start of my uh, FM eleven let's play. Um, oh come on, stop fucking getting oh, getting caught on possession in the middle of the field, just dawdling, doing nothing. They've lost, they've, we've lost this game now because of that. 
Valencia are two goals. We can't hold out against them. That's just fucking ridiculous. Uh, but yeah, for those who watch way back, um, I eventually sacked Samuel Lee because he was just pissing me off. Because he would do things like that where he would literally just tell every single player, uh, sorry, opposition instructions would be on every player hard tackling. Like it literally would just be hard tackling on everyone. And, um, you know, so there's a lot, we gave away a lot of fouls. Well, not necessarily red cards, but there was a lot of fouls and it really started to piss me off after some time. So, I, in the end, just stopped and sacked them. Oh, oh, Rami wins that one there. Fran Fran, he should have done better there. But, nevertheless, we have a call now. We'd be very happy if we got a nil-nil now. I'd take a nil-nil probably before the game started. Never mind now. Oh, oh, it's bounced around all over the place. Bit of uh, nervousness in the Valencia box there, but... If we can stick to counter-attacking, then, yeah, should have, oh God, three minutes of added time. They're going to score in this, aren't they? Well, they got a corner. It's probably it's going to play it out like the end of a second half, where it's just a com complete bombardment on your goal. <laughs> oh, no, well, no, they're not going to score. Well, four minutes, in fact, they ended up. Whew. Uh, I'm just going to say we can still come out of this match with a win tonight, although... I'm just going to say, um, pressure's off playing natural games, see what he does, because there's nothing else he can fucking do. I hate how everyone plays nervously, that is completely retarded. No one should ever be nervous, you're a professional footballer, why the fuck are you nervous? Um, never have I ever been nervous playing football, and I'm shit at it, and I go up against bigger boys than me, but still, I'm not nervous, I take them on, and end up on the floor, but who gives a shit? Anyway, I send Joe with a good save. We're gonna. I'm just waiting for the inevitable Valencia goal because it is gonna come. Well, if it if it if it ends up like that, I would have been pissed off, bouncing around all over the place. Oh, I might have to take Makeda off. I might bring Reyes on. Just a, I think I will actually. I think Reyes um, has just a little bit more pace than Mike. Oh, Adrian. I don't know too sure about Adrian. I'll give Reyes a go. What can Reyes play as? Uh, sorry, where does he play? He plays as. Left winger, advanced playmaker. That's really good to me. That yeah, I'm gonna say poacher because there's nothing else that's good. Why is he support by the way? That makes no sense. Um, I'm gonna say to Tiago also supports. We've got two supportive central midfielders and two attacking wide men. Let's play. Don't want to go attacking because that'll just relinquish it too much. Anyway, let's see what we get here. It's McKay. If that were Reyes, he might have started running there. But he's... come on, get an attack going. Come on. That's supposed to be counter. That means quick flowing football. Fucking hell, Makeda. What was that about? No effort at all there. And don't close him down. God, the space he had then. There was far too much space for him. My wells. In fairness, the, the five goals they scored in the Rage Quick game were all absolute 30-yard blinders. And I'm not even making that up. They were all blinders. And... Oh. Wow, we should have scored there. That was shocking defending. Paula Ferreira. Um... Hang on, is he a centre-back? Whoa, 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 whoa. Why the fuck is he at centre-back? I changed it. What the hell? Fucking hell. I changed that before. Why isn't... <sighs> Dear me. Too many bookings. Too many cards in general. Well, 20 minutes. Given a good account of us. Given a good... Uh, start like that again. Giving a good account of ourselves. Oh, Lopez with a free kick. And that is a shocking free kick. Absolutely rubbish. Let's see, how's he doing now? He's not even injured. He's Turan's... He's injured, apparently, but Turan's... Um, yeah, that made sense, right? Um, I'll bring Felipe on then for him, since he's injured, obviously. I don't want to aggravate it, since he does actually look like a decent player. Eight shots, in fairness, with ten men at the Mastaya. Not bad. Take that. I'm noticing there's no... Um, Sponsorship on the... Oh, Ferreira, come on! Oh, look at the space for them, and that's offside from Benega, so don't worry about that, but... Um, notice there's no sponsorship on the kits there for um, the Spanish teams. Or at least, I'm not... I think Barcelona have Qatar on it, don't they? But that's a charity, so... Or I think it is a charity. Isn't it a charity? Yes, they have a charity on their shirt, don't they? So I suppose they can let them off with that, but... Um, or it might just be Valencia and Atletico just so happen not to have... Um, Sponsorships, I don't know, that might just be me. I don't watch a lot of Spanish football, as I've said before, but I do know quite a few of the players. Of course, you know, you tend to know a lot about the um, League Champions, uh, sorry, the World Champions Leagues. Oh, yeah, he's offside, I think. I saw one sort of move back into position and, um, onside there, but right, I think we should really 
just go to defensive now. Oh, look at this play. <sighs> Turan's shooting has been shocking today. It's a decent effort. I suppose they've worked it well, but um, we're going to have to go defensive for the last five minutes. I don't want to get caught. Now, if we can end up with a point here with ten men, um, I would be very happy. And no, come on. Oh, don't do this. It's just going to... Oh, Ruiz. Oh, Victor Ruiz. Yeah, I think he might be going off. It is. It is a straight red for Victor Ruiz. Oh wow then! Well, we're gonna have to go to we're gonna go to standard. Actually, no, we're gonna go to control. We, we can get we can get them on the front foot here. Now we actually got a chance of winning this. Now, I think he um, helped to the elbow or something. I think the game said. Well, fuck that. We're both down to ten men each. It's back on. Three minutes of added time. What will happen here? Nothing. It didn't do anything. In fact, it evened it up. I'll still take a nil nil. Who cares? That was good. That was very good. Um, hello, Dominguez. I'm not happy at all with that. Single close confidence. You got sent off. What the fuck do you want me to say, you stupid twat? Makeda, um, appreciate your efforts, I suppose. Um, whatever. Make him happy. Um, yeah, draw. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Take that. <laughs> Just Barcelona renders La Liga pointless sometimes. Um, in fact, I'm going to find him a week's wager for that because you nearly bloody cost us the match, you stupid bastard. Um, I'll attend the pre-match, uh, post-match conference then. Um, yeah, it was a disgraceful tackle, whatever. <laughs> um, victories, I, I didn't even notice him. Thiago was good. Uh, he probably returned to squad, but yeah, accept your... Um, Please accept your fine, you, sta you daft bastard. So, um, we move on then to the Europa League. Now, this is the group. This is Group L. We are going up against Metalus Kharkiv. And in this one, um, I'm going to use this as a test run. So, it's to see if you guys want to see. Now, it is six extra games. So, you know, if you do want to see La Liga or the Copa del Rey or whatever, you are going to have to sit through these six matches. That is, if you want to see them. But I'll show you this. And if you don't like it, just say... And I will um, play the rest of the Europa League off camera because let's be honest here, I mean they're not difficult games, are they? So um, yeah, so that's that. I uh, hope you enjoyed this today. A very interesting game against Valencia, certainly hard fought, hard fought, and uh, proud to play. So um, thanks for watching, guys. See you for the Metalus game, and uh, take care. Goodbye for now. <laughs>